time for an exciting new episode of On The Spot with model, artist, photographer, entrepreneur, website manager, graphic designer, teacher, businesswoman, and all around friend, Miss Sheila Smith is now on the spot. All right, y'all, what's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> this is your boy, Janard. We are on the spot with yours truly, Miss Sheila Smith. How you doing, Sheila? Doing good. How you doing, Janard? Doing well. Are you ready to be put on the spot? On the spot. I, I guess so, yes. Okay. As ready as I'll ever be. Let's do this. Okay, alrighty. <laughs> well, we're just gonna go ahead and get into this thing, Sheila. Okay. Why do you do what you do? Why do I do what I do? What's well, my passion? So it's something I've always done. I love to paint. I love to draw. Um, I don't really know why I do what I do. I just do it. I'm just a little crazy person. I just I gotta have my outlets. You know what I mean? I see. I gotta. You. I'm very emotional. I gotta. I gotta paint. And then sometimes I'm You're a little crazy. Creative and artist. I'm very artistic, yes. And ever since the I've world. got to get it out there. So, okay, yeah. so when I ask well, I who I is Sheila Smith, which would be the next question, would you say she's an artist? I'd say she's crazy. She's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people might say I'm a little crazy. Okay. But um, no, I would say that um, I would say that I am an artist, a dancer. Uh, a little bit of everything. Maybe a Heinz 57. You ever heard that before? I have. A mix of everything, you know, okay. where they just throw a lot of stuff in a bowl and they mix. I'm a Heinz 57. She's a Heinz 57, <laughs> self proclaimed. Okay, yes. okay. So now, Sheila, you have experience six years in the modeling industry. Yes, I have. You have a lot of young ladies that grew up watching Tyra Banks, top model. I want to be a model, I want to be on the wrong way. Yes. What does the word and the profession modeling mean to you? Modeling. You really want to know what it means to me? I want to know. <laughs> Look good in front of camera. Ta -da, that's it. That's it. <laughs> no, it was a lot of fun. Um, I did it for six years. The girls that want to do it, be prepared because it's a lot of um, Basically, you got to keep yourself up. You got to work out. You were having somebody that watches everything you do. So you can't really roll out of bed and say, hey, I'm at work today. Did you need me? I mean, you've got to have like a two hour prep time of makeup and hair and you always have to be on the spot. I guess oh, say. wow. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. That's good. Y'all so, got to be on. You got to be on the spot. You got to be ready to go. As soon as you wake up, you can't, you can't have any downtime. How do you feel? Do you feel that there is some um, pressure that when people go and seek out a career in modeling, do you feel like there is some pressure and things that they really need to be prepared for oh, that a yes. lot of girls don't know about when they see Tyra and everybody else? Yeah, but I'm kind of halfway tempted to let them figure that out on their own. Oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> is that what Sheila had to do? That's what I had to do, yes. That's why I stayed in it for six years, and finally I was like, yeah, I'm just going to go be an artist. <laughs> awesome. So, yeah, there are some things they, they will learn along the way. Um, it's all fun, though. I'm not going to not gonna get rid of the hype of modeling. It's, it's a blast. Uh, you meet tons of new people. I okay. So many people I can go back and be like, hey, I met you at this show or this show. Like and fellow models. Other models, um, productions, uh, like productors, okay. directors. Um, I've just, uh, famous people. I know a lot of country music singers. Really? Yeah. And through music your, videos. Through your modeling career, you got to meet so Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, and that's now, one thing that's awesome. It's not to ask you to name drop, but will you name drop? No. <laughs> just some people you Let's met. just say, okay, I'm really good friends of Ruben. He was on. Um, Stutter. Yes. Yeah, shut up. Oh. Yeah, we're we're like this. We're <laughs> Y'all, that's send me an angel, Ruben. Okay, I need an angel. That is awesome. Yes. Yeah. So it's we just and you meet people like that. I was in his music video, and so it's shut really up. funny. Oh, let me tell you the story really quick. He took my dressing room. It was uh -oh. my dressing room. Uh oh. And Ruben. then. Yeah, Reuben, and then I came back, 
and I'm not going to go into details because it might be embarrassing for him. But let's just say he was in my dressing room, and <laughs> I was like, what are you, who are you, what are you doing? <laughs> That's how I met him. Wow. Now, which video of his were you on? The, um, you know, I heard it so many times, I don't remember the name of it. It was the one that was actually here. It was in the Opryland Hotel. We filmed really? it. Yeah, that's awesome. So it wasn't I Need an Angel, was it? Was it I Need an Angel? I don't know if that's what it was. Okay. I don't remember. I don't remember the name of it. Okay. And I don't want to sing it because well, that, I'm going to sing it totally wrong. <laughs> well, that's awesome just to be in a room. And you know what, yeah. guys, does it really matter which one it was in just to be able to say I mean, come you on. were in a Ruben video? That's awesome. I mean, I mean, I have the DVD. I can go get it. Do you? It in. Yeah. Do you? When this is over, I'm going to go get it, and we're going to have our little yes. sit down. Thing yes. Yes. So. Yes. Might have to air it at the end of this segment. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, Thank Sheila. You. So, wow. So, you were in Ruben's video. You got into modeling. You networked with some great artists, and you made the transition. When did you decide that, hey, I'm gonna be a business owner, I'm gonna do my art, I'm gonna do my photography. When did you decide, okay, it's time for me to retire from the modeling side and go and uh, sort of like grow up and, you know, be yeah, that one entrepreneur? Bit, yeah, a little bit more. Well, it was about two, one and a half years ago, I was a dancer for a country band, which oh, I, wow. I love and I love my fellow dancers too. Um, this is when I just kind of realized, okay, I'm done. Was I was a dancer with them, and uh, we were on a tour bus, and I realized I did not like tour buses right then and there. And, uh oh. Uh, yeah. Um, but it was just after that I was just like, you know, I would be busy on this tour bus, worried about what I look like all the time, worried about what I'm eating, like stupid, mindless stuff. I really should not be worried about at my age. And then I looked at all my friends, and they're having fun, and they have kids and a family, and I'm like. Hey, I want that life. Why well, am I on this tour bus, you know, with amazing people? I love you guys. Um, but I'm still like, you know, I, how do I get over there? You know, like, I, I've lived this life. It, it was fun. It was a you blast. More. I wanted a little bit more. I wanted a little bit more than waking up and worried about what I look like and what I'm eating. And got so tired of hearing what everybody, what their diet was for the week, you know? Uh -huh. Exactly. <laughs> so, and my passion has always been art. And so that's when I just, I just kind of made a, a little decision, you know, told my agency that I'm going to kind of take a little leave of absence and I just turned it around. Kind of like did a little 360 right then and there. So it's more like a 180, but you know. <laughs> we, know we know, we, 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 we know, we know what we you're know. going, we, we know we what you mean. We know, we know, we got this. So. so now Sheila and is that a decision that you can say I'm glad I made it when I made it? Absolutely. Absolutely. I loved modeling and I loved dancing and it was a lot of fun. Um, but I am super glad that I went to be an artist because there's there's something different about looking at somebody and saying, hey, look at her, she's a model. And then there's, hey, look at her, she's an artist. It's a little bit of a it different is. kind of respect. It so, is. You're right. I love it. So. You're right. And then I'm also, you know what? The best thing about it is I can paint in my job. Exactly. You but can't be a model and go to be on stage in your pajamas. You get yelled at, you get fired, you'd be like, buy it. Unless buy it's it. like a pajama <laughs> modeling show, uh, modeling yeah, fashion show. Yeah. How many of those do they have? <laughs> okay. Zero. <laughs> Point taken. Zero. Point taken. So what was your training ground for what you do now? For being an artist? Or the dancing, or the singing, or the modeling, or the which one? She does so much, guys, right? What was your training ground for being an artist? Oh, well, I've always been an artist. Since I can remember, I've been drawing and painting. I mean, I was I was the crazy kid that was stuck inside when all my friends were outside playing, and I'm inside like, wait, guys, let me finish this sketch of my cat, or something stupid. So, um, so I knew I wanted to go to art school. So I went to NOSI College of Art. It's great. NOSI or NOSI? NOSI. NOSI. I always say NOSI. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter how you say it. As long as you're speaking positive about them, I don't think they're going to care. But what? Uh, the best school ever. I absolutely love them. I uh, love you guys. Shout out, <laughs> NOSI. Shout out. <laughs> um, so I went there and got my degree. And then here I am. So they taught me a lot about having my own business, and that's kind of where I got that mindset. 
and I uh, took a, a couple courses actually on business management. So, where are you now? Greatest triumph so far. Yes, absolutely. Definitely. So, what drives you, Shiva? What drives me? My passion. A lot drives me, actually. Um, but definitely my passion.